Hey, my legion. How y'all doing today? Today I'm here to review the bomb, the bomb of the the bears beyond the sandy sauce. Now, when um my good friend uh Angel loves killer whales, and then she chained the orchards that are free. And is is you know it's cool. I mean, you know, everyone always you know some people change their channel names and stuff like that. Um, and uh. She, when I, she saw the Kawaii Co. Uh, pack, she said, you mean your peeps can send you stuff? I said, yeah. And, and then, you know, she gave me an e, uh, e dress and email. So I emailed her my, um, info. And then she was kind of sent us, and it arrived on Tuesday. And I said, like, if it's something like really crazy hot or something like that, I won't be able to do it till the weekend because, you know, work and stuff like that. you got to make sure you're not all cramped up from the night before, no matter what it is, you know. And I wanted to do this. And, um, now, whenever I say the bomb, I always think I reviewed it, but I reviewed the, the bomb ghost pepper sauce. This is the bomb beyond the sandy hot sauce. And it's a combination of habaneros and chipotle peppers. And if you ever watch Hot Ones, um, the interview show, the, now, I watched the game show on True TV. I, I only thought it was okay. I thought I was going to watch another episode. I think I only watched the one half hour, and then they showed, like, one of their interviews on YouTube, which is kind of lazy for True TV. I mean, it was on Friday. But I mean, I watched the game show. And was, I don't know. I wasn't interested enough to see it again. It just seemed to, I don't know. I think concept works as it would uh, in like an interview setting, you know. Um, and it seemed like there was some of the stuff was done for dramatic effect. Well, anyway, it did a cool uh, thing for the bomb. Cool. It reminded me of uh, Jerry's mustard gas, uh, which was in like a tear gas container. It was a mustard hot sauce, which was terrible. It gave me sour stomach. I, mustard just gave me a sour stomach. I didn't like it at all. Some people liked it. I didn't like it. I remember trying it a long time. I didn't care for that at all. But I, this is the bomb beyond sandy hot sauce. And it had like a little bit of info on it. Made in Kansas, which is cool. And it says, um, it looks, look at it. Formation is pretty chunky. Like that. I'm going to, I said I'd take a swig. I would like a little dip like that. I do I put it in a spoon. I'm going to take a swig. Okay, it says, we started with hot, so this is for Orcas Deserve Freedom. Yeah, it says, we start with, we started with hot habanero peppers and then blend them with smoky chipotle peppers and natural pepper extract to create a sauce that was lab tested at 135,600 Scoville units, wicked beyond belief, warning the sauce is extremely hot, keep out of reach of children, consume one drop at a time with extreme caution. Now, he said that, um, on hot ones, when they release that, that's like in the midway point, or could they start with the eating the hot wings from least hot to hottest? I think this is right at the midpoint or a little bit beyond it, and it always seems like it stops some people in the chat, and she has said, yeah, that's why I got it. She loved that show, so let's try it out. Open up the plastic cover. She sends this to me, which I thought was very kind of her. Okay. Almost, the lid almost came off, so you have to be careful. Never underestimate hot sauce, but I decided to take a little swig of it. Right. She's probably laughing. Smell it. Mm. Let me smell something hot. Let's try a little swig. Just a little one. Yep. <coughs> so I needed. Damn it. That was quick. It's really hot. I made sure to buy some milk. It's not helping at all. That's a tough burn.
it's just burning on the tongue really bad. Never underestimate any hot sauce. And it's just See, I'm crying now. I get the with a webcam. See in better detail. What is on the tip of my tongue? Well, that cut there is burning really bad. I'm clearing up. Bananas help some too. Well, I'm going to eat up these bananas before they go bad. Oh my god. <coughs> Well, for heat, the heat's a 10 out of 10. It's really hot. Flavor-wise, <coughs> maybe a 4 out of 10. It's very acrid tasting and fierce tasting. Do I have one of the times? As soon as you try it, you know you messed up. It tastes just like that. Not pleasant tasting. Hmm. Nine for seven to me. I'm going to use it, but. Usually, really hot stuff, you take a knife, you dip a little bit, and you smear it like on a sandwich. So I get the equal amount of heat. Still burn on the tongue. It's starting to be I can almost take it, Barrett. Mm. Oh, I just turn up. Um, I want to make sure I bought some milk because I didn't have any milk either. The price of milk went up. It was usually like a dollar eighty-two. It went up to a dollar ninety-nine. <coughs> Dean's Dairy Pure. Phew. Still burns, but oh god, that burned too. Now we'll have a fart alert. Where are you going, Angela? <coughs> Holy Christ. Shit's hot. But I mean, no, that's good, though. You just got to be careful. And this has no... Growing up, this will always have like a... 
Yeah. It's like your little thing, a dropper thing. They ain't got no dropper on it. You gotta be really careful. I they put a little knife in and dip it. Smear it. It's gonna last a long time. I remember we used to um I mean we used to order from different hot sauce places around Christmas time or uh, Uncle Bob would send money. <clears throat> a couple places was Blair's where they had the hot potato chips and the hot sauces. And then Dave's Gourmet, which does Dave's and Sandy sauce. And also Southwestern Specialty Foods, which had a bigger variety of stuff. It was Dave's Gourmet, which is pretty expensive. I remember getting Beyond Dave's and Sandy Sauce. Beyond the Sandy, I remember getting Dave's Beyond the Sandy Sauce. My dad wanted to try it. And my dad does it like this. He takes a hot sauce bottle. He goes like dips on his finger like this. But, I mean, this time it spilled out. It spilled out on his finger on something like a little, 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 little. Like, oh my god, he, I, he said he thought he was going to die. He, I still goddamn burn it. But he thought, he thought I was going to die. He, like, he started hiccuping real bad. But I had to burn it. It's burning right here on the lips. And it's burning on the tongue. So, I mean, you, I mean I'm mean, i starting to rag and tall right now. But it's hot. I don't know why I'm such a glutton for... I mean, you know, thank you very much, Angel, for sending this. But you have to be really careful with some of that stuff. <clears throat> you have to have a plan with it. Even if you're going to take a, I'll take a trigger. You have to have like a little somewhat of a plan of attack because you don't want to have so much that you end up throwing up all over the place. That's not good either. Give yourself an ulcer. And you just got to be really careful. I switched my webcam. I think it's a lot better this way. I had it right over on the edge right there. I wanted, I didn't want to make sure they didn't have on the webcam that's built in at a little one side. This is much better. I like this position better. Cool. So I hope you like this video. Uh Angela, I want to thank you for being my friend. You're a really nice, sweet lady. I, I care about you very much. And I mean that filter. I can understand that being saying that filter is annoying, but I don't know. I you have to take it for what it is. I'm probably annoying too. It's uh Hope you like this video. I know you're laughing probably, but that's okay. I know you care about me. So until next time, bye. Please take care, of my lady. It's, it just seemed like it's getting hotter on the lips. Now, there was one I remember unwrapped, where like uh, there was like some extra. He said, "Just try a little bit on a on a thing. You shouldn't even be trying this without diluting or something like that." Guy was getting like blisters on his lip or his lips were ring of fire. On the lips instead of ringing fire on the butt when you poop. I'll tell you what, those hot eggs. I'm going to go Saturday night. <clears throat> I crapped four. I had a bunch of those during that live stream last night. Six hour live stream, epic live stream. How I cat. Well, myself, of course. Rita, the, the Tiger Kitty, uh, the Froster new guy on there, and then Kathy. And I, I that was probably a 12, but I couldn't understand what the hell they were saying. Um, but, why well, I, I crap four times. I crap a lot. It's like, damn. With those, uh, that might be a new diet. Eat a whole bunch of pickled eggs and just crap all over the place. <laughs> I didn't get much gas. I just got a lot of crap. So, hope you like this video, everybody. Till next time, please. Take care of my lady. Oh, God. See, I got right there, Angela. See? It's weird because I keep wanting to look at here. They're right into the camera like that. I don't want to be like a guy in the face of death four like this. That guy was nuts. If you've ever seen him. Alright, take care.